Hello, I'm Andrew Jean-Baptiste. This is Raphael Rhino Oheen, and we're doing Winnipeg Tree Food. Hey, I'm gonna just start off by saying we love Winnipeg. Don't let this fool you, all right? What is the name of the statue modeled after the Roman god Mercury on top of the Manitoba Legislative Building? Is it the, the Golden Boy statue? My boy! My what is boy! That? Okay, okay. Come on, I'm all right, Winnipeg. All right, guy. all right. Ooh, you ready for this one? I'm gonna just point out he lived in Winnipeg. <laughs> you ready for this one? Right, go ahead. How many games did IGF host at the 2015 Women's World Cup? So A, none. B, 10. C, seven. D, five. You know the thing, I know they were there, but I just don't know how many games. I'm gonna go with five. Sorry, man. Is it seven? Seven. Yeah, <laughs> God. In what northern Manitoba town do some locals often leave their cars unlocked due to the significant polar bear population. A, Churchill. Ooh. B, Brandon. C, Flin Flon. I have to go see that now. Uh, D, Thompson. Hmm, so, Brandon is far away from the north? No. Mm -hmm. Churchill. Like I said, hey, he's a, he's a local, man. He's a local. Got it? Yeah, man. Come on, man. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> he's a local. All right, all right, all right. What is the name of the famous Winnipeg Bridge that was once featured on the Valo FC kit? A, Fox Bridge. Uh -huh. B, Assiniboine Bridge. C, Esplanade Rail. D, Norwood Bridge. The things I used to live near Assiniboine. This is the bridge where they had the restaurant and then they closed it down and then they opened up the cafe and then they closed it down and I know I know the bridge I, I know the bridge I just don't know uh, thought, that one is the Fox Bridge isn't it Huh Yeah <laughs> <laughs> Nah, it's nowhere bro nowhere nowhere No Yeah Golly, man. Is it, is it the C one? The one you pronounced? It's the C, yeah. God. <laughs> See, he mispronounced it. That's what t tossed me off. Man. What? Bro, I did it twice, man. Hey, just so you know, I love that area. I go there all the time. Maybe I might open up a restaurant on that bridge. Who knows? What famous fictional spy may Ooh. have been may have been based on a World War II soldier from Winnipeg? Boy. Mm -hmm. I wish I could give him a hint, you know? Do it. The most famous spy on, in movie history. Bro, I don't watch movies. Name, just name a spy. Bro, I don't know. You have to, you're gonna know the moment I say it. What, what was the joke that they made fun of uh, uh, Mudrik? He played his first seven games and had zero goals and zero assists. <laughs> 007, James Bond, bro, come on. <laughs> Literally, I can't think of any other spy besides Spy Kids, no? <laughs> He doesn't watch movies, guys. Sorry. I know. Sorry. So, which inspirational Canadian athlete was born in Winnipeg in 1958? Multiple choice? Multiple choice. Okay, thank God. I hope I don't pronounce the last names wrong. Sorry. Wayne... Gretzky? Gretzky? Gretzky. Gretzky. Oh, okay, you got it. Hockey legend, of course. Oh, B. Is it Donovan Bailey? C. There's a Scott. And then D. Terry Fox. In 1958. Terry Fox. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not going 0 4. I'm not going 0 4. Oh, you got that right. I got, got it? Right. I, I, I got knew it. Right. I knew it. Fox is, Fox is, Fox is a legend. Fox is a legend. Right. Those are, that's a, that's a good list. That's a good, that's a good, good question. Good question. Winnipeg is known as the capital of the world for this sugary drink, selling more of them than the rest of, the, uh, rest of Canada combined. A, Gatorade, B, Slurpee, C, Coca-Cola, D, my milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. Come on, man, I always get a Slurpee in the summertime. <laughs> I always get a Slurpee in the summertime. You get Slurpee? Yeah. Of yeah. course, man. You, you drink that with sugar? You drink that with sugar? Bro, why Yo, you coach, know? you know his sugar intake? <laughs> you know, it's, it's actually good on game days, you know? Bro, that's the easiest question I can ask. Yo, I know. Why do you get, why do you get the easier ones? Hey, I got to make Winnipeg proud, you know? I know a little bit of an issue hey, in Winnipeg hey, now. Uh, just so you guys know, just so you guys know, I love you. <laughs>